what I discovered, guys, that if what I say and what I do are congruent, I have a better chance of being successful. It's the craziest thing. It's the craziest thing. I learned that, Eric, if you say this and you do it, wow, success. So I'm writing a book, a chapter for a book, and I was supposed to get it in, I don't know, a couple of days ago, I told a guy I'm gonna be on a plane today, I'll get it done. I landed and said, I need to send it to my people so they can look at it, make sure I don't destroy the brand. But it's done, and I can send it to you, but you cannot publish it as is. Listen to me, guys, if you do what you said you were gonna do, that first moment when you got excited about this company, when you were fired up and you signed on the dotted line, right? And you were like, I'm committed. If, if you keep that, and do that thing you said because what's going to happen is between the time you said it and the time you're going to blow up life is going to happen can i explain to you in college i'm getting a phd and some people die along the way auntie died on the way. several aunts actually three aunts died from the top well actually five aunts died from the time i started college to where i am now guess what my aunts would want me to go to the funeral celebrate their life and get up and go back to school Right? I've had a grandfather that has died in the midst of my speaking career. My grandfather didn't want me to quit and give up on life. Can I explain something to you? The difference between average, right? And I, I'm allergic to average, man. Right? I hate good because good is a liar. Good perpetrates like it's great. So I got a real problem with good. But what I understand is that I say it, I do it, and life's going to happen. But what I have to do is I have to match life for every trial. That's why we're telling you the story so you can know. But look, some things in life, and I'm leaving you with this, some things in life you don't get, you gotta go take it. For real, there's some stuff that's happened for me. I didn't know it was signing a contract with companies and working for them throughout the course of the year. I have multiple Fortune 500 companies that I'm working for. Are you hearing what I'm saying? But guess what? Some challenges happen, life happened, and some things I had to go take. I had to go take it, like for real, guys. I was so accustomed to getting phone calls. Eric Thomas, can you speak here? Eric Thomas, can you speak there? The retainers didn't come from me sitting at home waiting on a phone call. The retainers came from me staying in contact with individuals, going to trainings that I wasn't getting paid for, picking up books and learning their philosophies. But the success will not come to you. Some things you got to take by force or you'll never have them. They not just, and nobody's going to not. Federal Express, listen to me. You will not be a multimillionaire. The people who are not going to get up in the morning and grind, the people who are not going to do what they're supposed to do, you just can't live off of folks no more. But the people who are ready to work, it's still money to be made. It's still money to be had, but the people who are ready to grind and tell and to shut, kill the noise, all the haters, you just laser focus. My friend, you gotta get that in your, like you don't even hear them anymore. If you're ready to take advantage of an opportunity of a lifetime, it may not be given to you, but if you're ready to earn it, the universe is yours.